Miami, Florida, where the sun shines, movie stars play, and 28-year-old film archivist Aaron dresses like a character from an 80s B movie. Image to me would be more about my personality. If I feel like crazy, I'll put on different colors and not match, and I don't care. Aaron wears tattered polyester dresses and crazy polka dot shoes to rebel against the sexy looks of South Beach. She doesn't want to look like everybody else. She doesn't want to look like she's in the box. Fashion stylist Stacy London and Clinton Kelly have brought the 360-degree mirror and the entire What Not to Wear set into Aaron's home to teach this nonconformist how to dress. Why are you being such a rebellious little child? Will Stacy and Clinton find the real Aaron under these goofy clothes? Nah. What do you mean, blah? Yeah. Or will this fashion rebel finally break Stacy and Clinton? We give up. Where's our white flag? But after braving the cold New York snow, finally following Stacy and Clinton's rules, and getting the star treatment from Nick and Carmendy, Erin is ready to show off her hot new look. Oh, God. So I want to show you two different looks. The first look is going to be a bold lip and a nice, sleek eye. It's all about balance. We're going to choose one feature to focus on. So if you're feeling sexy and strong and confident, go for the bold lip. I like it. I'm uh, very impressed. You it's, like? It's, so, it's like kind of looking at another person, actually. Looks absolutely amazing. Thank do you, you feel sexy? I do. You ready to try the second one? Align the inside rim with black, and then you choose a color, a bright color like this teal, to actually give you a smoky effect. And you just do it on top and bottom, followed with a highlight and then mascara. My goodness, are you ready to see yourself? Ready. Take a look at that. Okay, Erin, knock our socks off. Bring it. Is bra. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Yowza. What do you think? Aaron's satiny silver top costs twenty dollars, and designer vegan pumps five hundred thirty-five. Back in Miami, the heat rises as friends and family prepare for the new Aaron. 